Well, good morning, everybody. Linda Ray, Texas Girls Farm. I just kind of um, got the morning chores done, got the chickens fed and turned out up there. Went down to the garden and got a few more okra, a little bit, some little bitty like cherry tomatoes and some more peppers. I'll talk to y'all about that later. And then just when the, you know, haven't got back into the trailer to really work, but have been doing a lot of cleanup out here. So that's uh, the remnants of our brush pile from, um, I think it was from Saturday night. And then I've been adding to it every day. Um, I'm not going to add anything to it today, even though it's still hot. But uh, just kind of wanted to show y'all what I did a little bit yesterday. All that, it was right up along the, the tree line. And um, I just finally got tired of seeing all of it. Plus, I mean, you know, it just meant so much better when you can see where you're walking. But yeah, I did it all the way. Um, up to the top made individual piles and then maybe one weekend when the girls don't have Shane don't have ball games and they're not busy um we'll come and burn it but they're pretty big piles but it looks so much nicer plus if it rains this ground that hasn't seen sunlight you know really seen sunlight and for so many years is opened up and hopefully we can get some grass growing because i mean i showed y'all uh i clean raked all this up and made this pile a little more manageable but um there's a i don't know if you can see it the um grapevine growing on the on the fence right there that we left and there's some over here too but um yeah we got it all up here and then it just breaks up into grass there's a big old tree that's been down and got to finish cleaning that up um maybe thin some of the trees out but um yeah i think we opened this area up really good i was wanting that done and brooke Help me get it done and then I came back and cleaned the rest. But um I'm gonna again good morning everybody. Linda Ray, Texas Girls Farm. I wanted to sit down with y'all, catch y'all up, let y'all know what's been going on. Um uh, uh showed y'all what I've been doing out and around the property. It's so hard when it's pretty to uh stay in the trailer, but uh, I have been going in there and doing uh, a little bit of work um, not uh, go 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 like I was so um, yesterday I went in there with the little hand sander and started <clears throat> excuse me standing s sanding some of the uh, adhesive that was on the back of the border off of some of the walls and it worked uh, but it was taken off a little bit too much um, so but I did get accomplished what I wanted to do so today I'm going to try to start washing all the walls down and uh, I guess taking the cabinet doors off of the cabinets and try to maybe get them set up where I could start sanding them I kind of wanted to get all the sanding and everything done at one time so as soon as it gets done I could start painting them so I went down in the garden this morning and um uh, got some okra, got some little bitty, little bitty tomatoes, um, and the jalapeno. Not exactly for sure what this is. It is not a banana pepper. I've let them grow. My brother-in-law says they're hot. So, not for sure. Can't remember what I planted. And then I had these, which they look like chili peppers. And I've let them stay on the vine, let them stay on the vine, thinking they'd turn red or something. Actually, I've got some at my mom's house drying to see if they might turn red. And, um, yeah, I think these are little ch cherry peppers. So, I mean, the garden's still producing. Right now, I've got, turned on the water to water it just a little bit. Not a whole lot. Just give it a little drink. And then um, I'm going to go in and um, start washing down the walls. Um, 
I have a video, my videos, they've gotten out of order. Um, I've got one processing now, which is the third attempt of, um, of uploading it. I don't know if it's going to upload or not. I don't know what the problem is. So we'll see if that video gets uploaded. The shorter ones that I've been processing, um, after I uploaded that one and another one, I think it was, um, cleaning up the chicken pen which we cleaned up the chicken pen before we ever had the bonfire and cleaned up that area so if that tells you anything the video from the bonfire loaded uh sooner than clearing the chicken pen so, yeah who knows what's going on it's uh, that shane has a big tournament um her team saturday and uh, y'all keep her in your thoughts and prayers and all those little girls on her team, Team Elite, at Lindale, Texas. Um, those little girls, uh, it's, um, they're going to have to pay a lot of softball on Saturday. And my whole day will probably be at the softball game. And I'll try to record it. Um, uh, so that's that. It's it's crazy with them back in school. I'm so used to having them here. And Brooke uh, has been pretty much, when we do something, coming back over and staying with me. Matter of fact, from the bonfire, me and Brooke actually stayed in the trailer uh, Saturday night. And I don't know what I was thinking. I should have turned the heat on because it got a little chilly in there. But uh, we had we had blankets. Um, but next time we will turn the heat on. But uh, yeah, things are coming along slowly. I kind of slowed it down so I could do some workout, uh, you know, around the property and get some of that cleared up. Um, and then the weather's just too nice to not enjoy it. So um, I'll probably jump back on after a while if I get the walls all washed down and get everything prepped to paint and just let y'all know uh, how, how far I actually got so um, I think we're creeping up on lunchtime about right now and so I'm probably gonna you know go in there and fix me some lunch and then um, get to work so I'll be back with y'all in just a little. Well, I decided to get back on here real quick. Okay, that's been sanded, washed down, sanded, washed down, sanded, washed down. Got the cabinet drawers off that, all washed down. Got the couch moved out of the way. So, I think tomorrow I may try and paint this right here just to see how that paint's going to stick to it. And um, that way... I'll know if it's going to stick to that. If not, if I have to use the cabinet paint, going to try the door too. So just want to jump on here real quick, let y'all know um, wh what it is I've been doing. And the cleaning's a whole lot harder than you think. I took that one blind down. I do want to take the other ones down because I'm not for sure if I'm going to get that part painted. I figured I'd work on this little small area right here first see how it goes and then um yeah then we'll be moving on okay well just want to jump on for a short let y'all have an update and i hope y'all have a good evening linda ray texas girl farm uh enjoy y'all watching and if you're interested in this kind of content go back to some of the other videos i've put out to look at this rv repair and renovation